Corey. Hey, I'm Johanna. Welcome back to CNJ44. We're up in this thing. <laughs> bitch. I don't know. Yeah, We're man. all up in here. Man, up in um, this bitch. Well, Johanna, have you ever tried generic foods? I have. Because uh, that's what this video is about. Yeah. We're going to taste test some uh, random generic foods that we can <laughs> random. To pick out from the grocery store. Yep. So we have uh, name brand foods that we're going to eat. Yep. And we have generic foods that we're going to eat. And we're going to rate them. Yeah. We're going to decide which one is better. Is it yeah. worth Is it worth, is uh, it worth saving the money? the money? Right. Or not? Yeah. Yeah, I, I get it. I get it, people. I know this has been done before on the internet. But we've never done we've it. We've never done it. So, so we figured. We thought it'd be fun. Eh, something different. So we're going to do oh, it. Oh, something different. We're going to do it. And yeah. first up is beans. <laughs> Beans, beans, the, the magical fruit. Yeah, everyone knows they're magical. That's right. And, um, That's right. Yeah, so, yeah. Here we go. Ooh, it's hot, people. I'm going to move my cup over here, just so the beans are more prominent on the camera. Spoons. Oh, I have my own spoons. Well, yeah. Okay. That's so beautiful, actually. Um, all right. So, yeah, here we have um, Bush's baked beans, the Bush's original, original style. And we have um, Stop and Shop style generic brand. Um, I want to get this out of the way right now. Uh, this is not a sponsored video, video by uh, any means. No. Um, it's not. We but usually all, all the shop at Stop and Shop, so all yeah. our generic for, for store any brand of things you, today any of will you be who Stop don't and know shop. what Stop and Shop is if you don't live in the Northeast. It's the prominent grocery yeah. store. Yeah. Um, uh, but the Bush's baked beans here were a dollar eighty nine, and the Stop and Shop beans, same size, were only ninety nine cents. Ninety nine cents. So let's see which is which. What do you want to try first? Well, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try the store brand first. All right. Well, I'll I'll try Bush's first. All right. They're gonna be hot. So be careful. They are steaming. Oh, so magical! I love baked beans. These are good. These are good. Um, but let me I'm try these. Maybe cleanser. maybe these are just as good. Johanna, while I'm trying that, why don't you tell the people about what? what's in that glass. Ooh, this is a frozen, drunken Arnold Palmer. It's a CNJ 44 version. We get a little um, iced tea, splash of lemonade, and some wow. vodka. These are... Try, try this before I say anything. Okay. Before I say anything, I need to try the Bush's uh, name brand stuff. Um, and I'm going to have to go back and forth a little bit here because... These are close. The 99 cent beans. Oh, they're hot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you said that. I just burned my tongue a little bit. We'll but, have a sip of your frozen. Yeah, they'll cool my tongue down. Sip of your frozen. Now, obviously, <clears throat> you know, Corey and I, we've been together for a while, so we're not going to get grossed out by our repeated dippings of... Our spoons. Oh, double dip. Yeah. Double dip. Yeah, we don't give a shit. About that. <laughs> double dip. Double dip all day long. Especially these beans. <laughs> They're good. I like both of them. Honestly, I'd be hard pressed to tell the difference. If somebody told me those were bushes, I wouldn't argue. I wouldn't argue. Yeah. What do you think? I, I would have to agree with you. Right. I mean. They're super close we, in we flavor. Always, we always buy the bushes baked beans. We always buy we the bushes. always buy the bushes. I, I honestly, it's, it's, these are close. I'd have to say. Uh, save some money. Buy the 99 cent Stop yeah. and Shop brand. Yeah, the They're bushes good. were $1.89. Stop and Shop was 99 yeah. cents. And really? Save it. Save 80 cents. Yeah, 90 cents. 90 cents. 90 cents. I got, I got good math skills. <laughs> All right, so, Johanna, next up, Cheez-Its. All right, so... Okay, I, we got Cheez-Its on the table, yeah. people. I have um, the generic version. And I have the 
name brand Cheez-Its over here. Yes. Um, the legit Cheez-Its. The, these are the, the name brand legit Cheez-Its. And you can kind of tell the, these are the, by the, the color. S, these are the s and brand. Yeah, it's obvious by color that there's a difference. There's a, there's a difference. They smell the same. Do they? Yeah. I like that you smell them first. Oh, shit, they... what did I just eat? The generic one. <laughs> <laughs> Which one was it? Um, unfor people forgive me, I'm still getting over a cold. My sense of smell is not is not all there today. And I probably sound a little nasally, but... Um, You're fine. It might affect my tasting as well. So I tried the, the cheese it first. Mm -hmm. let's, and I, I gotta be honest let's right be now. Fair. I gotta be honest, and I gotta tell you people that I don't like Jesus. He does not like Jesus. They have, they have a weird aftertaste. I don't like it. Um, and that is the taste that I'm getting in my mouth right now that right. I do not like. Right. So I'm gonna try this one. Well, maybe I should. Yeah, do a Maybe I should rinse cleanser. out because the cracker sticks to your teeth, right? Mm. So let's wash away the the uh, cheese it brand cheese it yeah. and um, try the generic. Right. Well, you already tried it. Yeah, I did. What do you think? I think I like the generic one better. Honestly, it's a little bit lighter. It's lighter. It's. I have to agree with you. It doesn't have the crappy aftertaste they hate about cheese its Yeah, isn't that funny? It's not there. That's so weird. Uh, wow. Jesus, Jesus. I am a name brand guy. I'm a name brand guy. I'm always like, Johanna, don't buy the cheap stuff. I want the name right. brand stuff. Right. But here I am. The cheese is liking... were three ninety nine a box. Yeah. And the Stop and Shop brand was two nineteen a box. And I, I really do like these better. These are better. Yeah. These Those are better, people. I would agree. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess that's our decision. Right? Um, yeah. So far, Stop and Shop is... So good. far, Stop and Shop's killing it. We never buy generic stuff. We, we really don't. don't. This is why we did this video. Because we, we don't buy generic right. stuff. But uh, we're learning some things here, know, Johanna. And maybe the people watching are learning some stuff. All right. That being said, all right, next up, granola bars. Yes. That's right. Granola bars. Um, so bars. we have, so we have here uh, Quaker, the name brand on my side. Yeah. Uh, peanut butter and chocolate chip. Yeah. That's what these ones chewy. are. They're the chewy style granola bars. Right. Um, and we found Stop and Shop made right. uh, chewy peanut butter chocolate chip granola bars. Yeah. The same flavors. Virtually the identical. The same flavors. Well, we're gonna find out. We are. We're gonna find out. We're gonna open them up right now. Yep. Do we need to open both? You want to just Probably break not. them in half? Yeah. And we we can might. Share one? We might. Well, we don't want to waste any food. I know. That's why you guys cheese is still on your plate. I know. Well, they're good, man. Yeah, they're those good. are good. I would eat those. Mm. I'm familiar with these. I'm familiar with these, the name brand. Right. Um, I'll put this one on your plate. Sorry, I touched it. I'm going to take this one. I'm scared. I know, you're afraid of my germs. I got cooties. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. People, whatever. <laughs> I'm still eating the the, the Quaker That's one. That's the generic I'm to be one. Try, I'm supposed to be trying the generic one. I tried the generic one first. I want to get the I want to get the Quaker one out of my mm. um, mouth orifice before I try the next one. Mm. Mm. There's a significant difference here. There's a significant difference here, and I guess it comes down to what you prefer. This one has the generic one is coated in like honey or sugar, and it's very sticky. Mm. It's sticky on my fingers, and it doesn't add to the flavor for me. No, and I think I think the um the chewy. You can really taste like the granola. Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah. The granola is it's very granola forward. <laughs> but that's what you want if you're eating but a granola, a granola bar. bar, right? This this is I don't. I'm sorry, Stop and Shop, you failed in the granola area. 
at least on the chewy ones. I haven't tried any other granolas products. Granolas products? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> anyway. I'm still chewing, uh, I'm sorry. Well, what is the cost difference, Jordan? What is the cost? cost difference. These are, the, the generic ones are not bad, but the They're Quaker, not is, bad. Quaker is significantly better. Right. Um, this is just our opinion, people. Of course. But the chewy opinion. granola bars were $3.49 and the stop and shop were two fifty nine. So, a little... Oh, like 90 cents. Yeah, 90 cents for the cheaper ones. If you If you need to save money, there you go. There you go. And honestly, little kids, whatever. Well, oh. yeah, your kids aren't going to know the difference, are they? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. All right, next! Nutella and peanut butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Peanut butter and Nutella. We're doing... Johanna has the generic. Yep. I have the name brand, so I have... we have Nutella and Skippy peanut butter over here. Yep. Uh, it's a spread test, right? Peanut butter sure. is a spread. Nutella is a spread. Right. Uh, we placed them on honey graham crackers. We're not doing generic. It's the graham cracker is just a vessel. Just All right, peeps. Uh, it's just a vessel for us to taste the product. Right. That's on top of them. Right. Uh, what do we want to do first? Peanut butter or uh, Nutella? I, I'm not hugely familiar with Nutella flavor, honestly. I'm thinking go with the peanut butter first. All right. So. Um, I'm going to try the generic peanut butter first, because I am familiar with the flavor of peanut butter. I've eaten it my whole life. Right. And although we usually get the Skippy Creamy Natural, this, this is, is just not, This is not the natural, because we couldn't get the generic, generic that said natural. natural. So we wanted to do an honest comparison. This is just straight up regular Skippy Creamy peanut butter. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is. This is the Stop and Shop. And right. it's not bad. It tastes okay. Yeah, it tastes, tastes like good. peanut butter. Sure. Is it better than the Skippy? I don't know. I got peanut butter on my finger. I fingered my well, peanut, I fingered my peanut butter. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's people. <laughs> John, don't laugh at my jokes. They're not funny. <laughs> Alright, so this is the Skippy. I'm trying the Skippy. Mm. I gotta be honest, I know that we usually buy Skippy, but this is better peanut butter than that. In my opinion. It's both peanut butter, I get Honestly, that. Honestly, I can't tell the difference. I can. This is creamier and smoother. And maybe it's because we chose graham crackers to, to decide them. Yeah, there you go. Let's look at well, I need to get a better. Yeah. Yeah, no, I agree with you. Look it. Negate the graham cracker. What do you You're think? right. Skippy is smoother. It's, it's better. Skippy is smoother. It's better. It tastes yeah. better. It's a little bit better consistency. Yeah. Um, so what's the price difference? What's the price di difference? Is it worth Is it? Worth it? Well, it's worth it for us because I'm never going to buy anything other yeah. than Skippy Natural <laughs> Creamy Peanut Butter. But no, whatever. We like um, it too much. Yeah, so the Skippy was two ninety nine. I'm sorry, I just spit there. And uh, the Stop and Shop brand was two forty nine. Well, there you have it. So um, for me, I'm spending the extra fifty cents. Uh, that's I think. what I was about to say. And it's funny because at first I'm, I, I'm willing to throw I couldn't down, tell the difference. But. I'm willing to throw down the extra fifty cents for the Skippy. Yeah. it's worth it to me. Uh, right. Moving on to the the Nutella um, first generic Nutella hazelnut chocolate spread. Um, should we look, let's do the lick test first. Should we try Nutella first? I got oh, the right piece off, of the right off, on my right, first. I'm with you. I'm with you. But right off the bat, visually, the Nutella is um, not as thick as the generic brand. No, I can thick. tell. Like that, it's a lot thicker. Yeah. Whether that negates to a better uh, hazelnut chocolate spread, I don't know. We haven't tried. And it like yet. Corey said. We're not big Nutella eaters. No, we're not. So but a lot of people love it. A lot of people love it, yes. So we figured, what the hell? Right, so you're trying the Nutella first? I'll try the Nutella first. I figured, we're gonna yeah, do the lick figured, test. yeah, we'll, we'll do the lick test. 
<laughs> this tastes pretty good. It tastes like chocolate with hazelnut, and I don't. I'm a big fan of um, from Piero Rocher. Am I pronouncing mm. that right? The oh. candy with yeah. the hazelnut in the middle. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, this reminds me of that. This reminds me of the what's in the middle of it, mm. surrounding the hazelnut. Yeah, I agree. That's good. It's good. I like it. And we didn't eat the graham cracker. Well, that's all right. As we said, the graham cracker is just, just the, the best. We should have just got spoons and friggin' ate it like that. If you get it on my face, I'm not going to be happy. I legit was trying to get it on your face. Oh, I should have cleansed my palate. No, I was good. This is nuttier. Is this the generic? This, this is, the generic. is the generic, yeah. I kind of like it better. I think it tastes nuttier. I, it, it does I think taste it's a nuttier. little less chocolatey. A little less disagree. chocolatey. Chocolatey. But it has a generic taste to it to me. Oh, maybe you're right. It has an, an off. There's something off on the back end of it. There's something off on the back end of this generic Nutella. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm going to pass on that one. What is the price difference? Well, I will I tell you. I don't Nutella, but it's up to you guys. We're just letting like, you guys know. A smaller, we bought, we bought the small size. The Nutella. small size of Nutella. I want to say it was 7.2 ounces. Yeah. was $2.79, and the Stop and Shop version for a 13 ounce. They didn't have can, a, they didn't have an equal size jar. Right. For us it was, to buy. um... Three fifty nine. So you got almost twice the fake Nutella for less than a buck more, right? If you want. So I don't know. I don't really. I wouldn't bother. I wouldn't bother buying it. Period. I don't like Nutella. I don't. I don't per like se. It. I mean, it's all I don't right. Like don't get me wrong, but um, but I feel like if you know. See, I, it's a spread, right? You're going to put it on a sandwich or something, or a piece of toast. toast. I, I'm a savory man. I prefer yeah. butter. I'd rather peanut butter on my toast than this. Then Either one of these. Hidden, um, Either one of these. You'd I'm, have toast I'm, I'm with butter and uh, cinnamon and sugar. That was fucking good. Oh, that is good. We're getting way off the yeah, rails. Yeah, we're, we're going off uh, the rails. All right. Yeah. So, switching it up for the next one, we're going for a beverage. Coke Zero. Woo! That's right, zero calorie cola. That's what we're about to taste test. We got uh, the legit Coke brand, Coke, Coke zero. zero. That's Corey's go-to uh, beverage. That's, well, soda's full of sugar, um, so we don't drink it. Right. Um, is is artificial, is artificial sweetener better for you? I don't know. No, it's not. But is the Stop and Shop uh, Zero Calorie Cola better than Coca-Cola Zero? 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 Jesus. <laughs> it's like a tongue twister. <laughs> zero Calorie Cola better. We're, we're about to find out. We're about to find out. And I tell you what, I'm just going to put, I'm just going to say it right here and now. I feel like the Stop and Shop Zero Calorie Cola is going to suck balls. Uh, judging by the color, it's it's not as dark. No, it does, it, it it's less cola looking mm. to me. It looks watered down. Yeah, I don't know. Um, We're gonna give it a try. So well, I know the flavor of this. I so have let's, the generic. Over so here. let's try the generic first because right. I already know I already know that flavor profile. Right. Oh yeah. Oh god, that's gross. That's bad. Yeah, it's gross. super watered down. It tastes nasty. It's, it's not, not good. good. It's not good. That's horrible. I need to. I need to cleanse yeah. my palate from that um, garbage. Oh yeah, that's way better. This is way better. This is way better. Yeah, yeah. Um, and I, you know what? I had preconceived notions, so maybe that was. Oh, as did I, but it's obvious. Yeah. The flavor of yeah. that is junk. I mean, we weren't trying to it's not pick good. out which was the store where. I, which was, no, we're it not. It was just. Is it worth it to? Is it worth it, it to save the money? No, I'll tell you the price right now. Yeah. Uh, the difference is uh, 
Coke Zero for a two liter bottle of Coke Zero is a dollar seventy nine in most places, and uh, the Stop and Shop brand is a dollar nineteen. Pay the extra sixty cents, people. Right. Because that is shit. It is shit. It's junk. It's garbage. All right. So, um, our final, our final taste test. Um, we're going sort of desserty. I guess it's a dessert. Chocolate chip cookies. Yeah. That's right, people. Chocolate chip cookies. Here we go. We got Chips Ahoy. Yep. As you know. Everybody and knows the Chips Ahoy Over cookie. here we have, the again, Stop and Shop generic brand right. of chocolate chip crunchy cookie. These aren't soft cookies. These are no. crunchy cookies. They're crunchy cookies. Although They're I, crisp Maybe cookies. we should have brought milk in. Ah, oh, milk might have made a difference. But that's okay. Oh, well, we're straight. We're we're doing a straight up taste. It looks test. like the chips in the Chips Ahoy are milk smaller. Milk might have been a good idea, right? Because then you could have judged how it would soak up the milk, how quickly or how, how mushy it would. Have got. I don't know, but we didn't get milk, didn't get people. Milk. We Sorry, milk. we failed on the milk. Part. Well, we can't have milk in. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So this is the generic cookie. I'm gonna try the Chips Ahoy first. Oh, it tastes good. <laughs> Me like it. Um, I prefer a soft chocolate chip cookie over a crisp chocolate chip cookie, but Chips Ahoy doesn't do a bad job of a crisp cookie. No. Alright. I guess I gotta try this one. Yeah. I'm right off the bat, there's more chocolate chips than the Chips Ahoy one. Yeah. There's, there's more... There's more chocolate chips in the Chips Ahoy than the generic one, which already is, it's got a bad mark on it right off the bat, right? I haven't even tried it yet. But maybe the dough tastes better. This is a harder cookie. It is. It's harder. It's not as crisp. This has more of a graham cracker texture to me than a cookie texture. This is more crackery than cookie to me. Does that make sense? The Chips Ahoy is better. Yeah. The Chips Ahoy is better. Stop and shop. You've, you've, you've won us over on a few things, um, but the last few things, um, yeah, I would say you failed. We don't usually buy chocolate it's, chip cookies, and honestly, no, like, your your kid's not going to know the difference. Well, Maybe yeah. they will. Well, oh. yeah, if they're, but, um, if they're three, they don't know. <laughs> the Chips Ahoy were $3.59, and the Stop and Shop brand was $2.09. So um, it's kind of a considerable savings. It, it is a considerable and savings. If, if you're just, feed, if you're just and... feeding it to your kids, <laughs> save some money. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, listen, if you want a gourmet chocolate chip cookie, then that's one thing. But if you're just getting cookies for the kids to eat, the neighborhood kids that are coming over. I, I agree with you, Joanna. I want to stop yeah, shop save, save some money. Yeah. Um, buy the cheap cookies. I agree. For the neighborhood kids. <laughs> <laughs> We're assholes. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching. People, you thank guys. you for watching, liking. Uh, please hit that subscribe button for us yeah. if you if we made you laugh. And um, yeah, tell your friends. Tell your friends. Peace out.